Hey guys, so this video is for those wonderful people that are supporting me and have pre-ordered the high precision Wi-Fi enabled, super accurate, super fast, super cool voltmeter that I put up for pre-purchase that are going to ship next month. So I have finally selected the case I'll be using for them. This is a shape, this is a 3D printed prototype, and this is the quality that you can expect. It's all aluminum. It's going to have very nice UV logo on it, laser printed text, and basically this is what we're looking at size-wise. This is the final size. My goal was to make this as compact as possible, so I'm waiting for the latest iteration of the PCBs to arrive this week, and essentially it'll be like this, but a little bit shorter, and the PCBs will slide into the case right here. That's where the PCBs go. Then we have two end caps. At the bottom of the voltmeter, I'm going to use these connectors. You have power, you'll have ground, you'll have remote, which turns it on and off, and then you'll have an optional third pin. That third pin will allow you to monitor secondary voltage levels. So the first primary voltage that is being detected by the voltmeter is the 12 volts going into the meter. However, some of you like to run your voltmeter at the front where your dash is and to detect the voltage of the amp at the back. So we're going to have that extra pin that allows you to run a wire and detect the voltage all the way at the back of the car. That way the voltmeter can be at the front. If the logistics work out, these will be shipped out next month. Again, I have a limited run for the pre-order units. Thank you for those of you who have already pre-ordered some. If you haven't already, check out lf-audio.com to pre-order yours. Again, these are Wi-Fi enabled, super accurate, three decimal places of precision and accuracy, Wi-Fi. So you'll be able to connect to it from your phone, get over the air updates, be able to download the logging data, they have a peak hold, minimum hold, and all kinds of cool graphing functionality on it. I'll show more on all of that once I have the final metal cases and PCBs. That way I could show off the final product. Again, thank you for your support.